Hey everybody, it's Pastor Mike. Thanks for tuning in again uh, this week to hear a short message from me. Um, I hope you guys had a great Easter and a good chance to get together and, and hang out together. Just a few of you, of course, 10 or less. Um, uh, but you were able to maybe watch a church service or two, listen to some sermons. I know that's what we were doing. And uh, hopefully you got a chance to spend some time in the Word and all that sort of good stuff. You know, I was thinking um, about all that's going on, and maybe you're feeling a little bit like the writer of Ecclesiastes. And the writer of Ecclesiastes essentially asks this question, what's the point of life, right? What, what, are, what are we doing? And it's easy to feel that way. It's easy to feel that way right now, especially if you've, you're feeling stuck. You're feeling stuck for one reason or another. Maybe you've lost your job and you're feeling stuck in finding another one. Uh, maybe you're just feeling stuck inside and you don't and you just miss people and uh, you're feeling like what's the point of all this and it reminded me of another uh, passage in scripture in Ephesians chapter 3 which this particular uh, paragraph is just fantastic it says it says for this reason I bow my knees before the father right and uh, from whom every family in heaven on earth is named that according to the riches of his glory he may grant you to be strengthened with power uh, through his spirit in your inner being I don't know about you but uh, I need that right now so that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith that you being rooted and grounded in love what love what love are we talking about we're talking about the love of Christ and that you being rooted and grounded in that love of Christ may have strength to comprehend with all the saints what is the breadth and length and height and depth and to know the love of Christ that surpasses a knowledge that you may be filled with all the fullness of God may that word uh, today encourage your hearts as you uh, wrestle with all that's going on as you try to figure out uh, what it means to you well know this what this means to you is what matters most. And that's Christ dwelling in your heart and being filled with the, all the fullness of God. That blows my mind. I don't even know how that's possible. I don't think it's even possible to know how it's possible. Look, I love you guys. I miss you all. Hopefully we will get, to bet, get together soon again and be able to get back together, hang out, sing together, hug each other. I look forward to that day. God bless you guys.